Welcome back to Sara Sarar Nation. This is Frank. So this was going to be part two of the Make Your Own Comics uh, Blank Comic Book Review. Uh, I ended up doing a very quick unboxing video because I got the Make Your Own Manga books in, in the mail. So I just wanted to uh, show that very quickly. So that was a very quick video. Uh, I was going to do a separate video just showing those books. But um, I ended up just doing the unboxing. So if you still want to see that video where I just talk about the manga books uh, just a, a little bit more. And so you can actually, I'll do a size comparison with the uh, other books. So if you want to see that, just leave a comment and yeah, yeah, that yes, you do want to see that. Uh, so I'll know, uh, you know, that someone actually wants to see it and, you know, I'll, I'll do the video. It doesn't have to be many comments, just one. <laughs> Any excuse to just show you the, the cool stuff that Scott makes. Uh, so, um, what I originally had planned for this video is that I was going to show the other two books in the series. And then I was going to show the Make Your Own Heroes books and can do a character design. But I don't want to ru rush uh, those uh, character designs because I'll probably do more than one. So that's going to be a, a separate video where I do show the Make Your Own Hero books uh, separately and and just work on some character design. So that's going to be a separate video. So this should be a relatively uh, quick video. Um, uh, so uh, let's just get to it. Here are all the three uh, blank comic books from the Make Your Own Comic series. These are specifically the ones with the, the panels, with the, the borders. So we had already uh, talked about this one. We already seen it. This is the one we did the comparison with the other books. Uh, but this, this one has the uh, word balloons and captions. This one has the sound effects. And this is just the... the the one with the borders and panels by itself and I do want to address something I had said in the first video uh, I, I wasn't too sure so I didn't really say that much about it but I, I did say that they were kind of light I was mentioning that the lines were were very light uh, so when I was trying to record at a certain angle I was, I was uh, sitting behind the desk and just showing the books uh, it wasn't coming up it, you know you couldn't see the pages so um, I decided just to stick with this type of, uh, of angle where I have the camera phone just uh, facing on, on the books directly. So you can see them a little bit better. Uh, but that was done on purpose. Uh, there was a design be behind this. You can customize the panels to your liking. So if there's uh, some, some panels that you don't want to use, you can just... Uh, you know, fix them, um, move them around with a, with a pen and go from there. These are meant to be guidelines, so you can uh, change them around if you want. And that's just another reason why these books are, they, they just blow the other blank comic books out of the water because you can customize them. You can change them around. And it was done like that on purpose, so you can do the comic you want to do. Now you can make your own panels. You don't need these, but these are a great reference point or a great starting point. And I just wanted to address that. So this is the make your own comics with word balloons and caption boxes, over 100 pages for kids of all ages. So we'll just uh, go through it quickly. It has the, the same stuff uh, as the other ones. And let's get in closer. All right, so here's a here's the first page, and I mean I'm 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 like this already. Like I like the first page because it looks like it's an actual first page from from an actual comic. So it already has the caption box up here, so you can do like a cityscape. You can have a character here or or a, or like. I'm, I'm imagining, you know, a street view, you know, cars lining up and there's a little car here, and, you know, there's someone talking and then it goes in, inside and, you know, it's the person talking and I'm, I'm already imagining a story. So here's some, some other ones. This is 
my favorite uh, word balloon. <laughs> These are cool. I think uh, you can even use these as templates for if you want to do character cards. You know, have have your character drawn here, and you know he's he or she is saying something, or it. You know, you can do robots or whatever. Nice, 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 nice. I've seen. Uh, I, I think I. I had done a video where I, I showed a a make your own comic book kit and it was an actual uh, box it had a a book and it had a it had the panels of the speech bubbles and some markers and, and I think uh, some little stencils and which was for you know for kids for kids to to play around with I, I like this a lot better. I wish I still had it just for comparison, but I I, I gave those to my sons and, and as far as I know, they liked it. <laughs> I don't know if they still use it. Um, but just looking at this and and if you, you can you can probably go look at the other video, but just from what I remember, uh, these all these pages look much more professional. And I don't really like getting uh, the black comic books like this with the word bubbles because I want to choose where when my character talks or doesn't talk. But I mean, right off, as soon as I opened the first page, I was already getting ideas. And this is cool. I mean, I like it. I mean, it's. Uh, I I'm I'm trying to think of something, you know. To say just to, just so it's a uh, you know could give you pros and cons, but I mean I'm not thinking of any cons right now. So all right, I mean I really like it. I mean <laughs> there's really not <laughs> no other thing I can say. I, I just really like this. I'm already getting ideas. I mean I want to go jump on making my my comic now. Uh, which I'm gonna do after this video anyway, but uh, but that was the make your own comics with balloons and caption boxes. Now let's get to to the other one. All right, it's getting closer. Uh, same stuff. My comic creations. All right, right off. Screech, zap. Vroom, rattle, ha ha ha. Zoom, clang, screech, kapow. I like this, I like the Kirby crackle. Buzz, bam. Zoom, clang. Kapow. Bang. Smash. Boom. Uh, here, I just, I just picture drawing the Joker here. <laughs> the Joker and Batman around here somewhere. So what you can do if, if you get uh, if you get all three of these, or even if you just get uh, this one and and the one with the captions, well, you're doing that. Might as well just get all three of these. <laughs> you can take out a, a page from from each and overlay it. So like I was saying here, I was already thinking, you know, 
this is more of a street view where you see, you know, maybe a car jam or a car in here somewhere and just overlay it here and then you have that sound effect. And like I said, you know, these are guides so you don't have to have your characters uh, talking in every panel if you don't want them to. You can fix that when you go over it with, with a pen. Uh, let me show a little bit of the back. So let's see. Uh, make your own comics, comic layout templates. I have that one. Actually, I have all of these. So, superhero templates, a comic thumbnail guides, and you know that you know that's it. I haven't seen uh, many of, of these uh, blank comics with the sound effects. Um, I'm sure there's there's some out there. I just haven't haven't seen them. Oh well. And see, this one has a Kirby Crackle too. That's cool. But I mean, I like them. You know, you can get them for your kids. You can get them for for yourself. If you make comics, want to make comics? If you want, if you just want to start, you can just uh, pick up one of these and you know just start creating a comic and you already have you know some professional uh, layouts some professional panels and borders before they make your own comics books there was the comic maker star kit which is absolutely free and the comic maker toolkit which you can get on Scott's site those are digital downloads uh, but I printed out some of the the uh, pages So this is the American standard uh, size page for the layout. So getting a little closer, you can see some of the lines there. Now uh, the lines are light like that uh, because you can customize it when you do your ink drawing, it'll pop out more. From the digital version, you can just uh, just remove remove that in the layer and uh, I have the I have the manga version also, the manga size, and I have that right here. Right, that's the manga version. And when I print it out, I, I print out uh, 50 page, so I'm not sure if it'll print out smaller. Or I don't know, depends on your printer, I guess. And it, the thumbnail guides, I have that right there. Since the page layouts and the thumbnail guides uh, were coming out lighter, I made the turnarounds darker because I was having trouble uh, just seeing them on, on camera. So I took the turnarounds, I printed them out uh, regular and then I printed out the darker versions and the darker versions I will be using as references. The current Make Your Own Heroes books has the male turnaround and the female turnaround. So you can get those in the books. I also print out the Behemoth, which you can get in the Comic Maker Toolkit. As far as I know, it's not in the it's not a, a in book form yet. Uh, but you can still get the Comic Maker Toolkit and just print out your own copies. And here's the female turnaround, so you can see that better. Put this here. All right, so I'm not sure exactly. Oh yeah, okay. This one is in the toolkit, the Comic Maker toolkit. It might be in the Star Kit, but I don't remember. So, uh, but this is the Dan Harmon Story Circle. I'm just gonna flip through these real quick, just so you can get an idea of what comes with both kits. This is the mind map, and it does come in the Star Kit and in the toolkit. So that's some of the stuff that you'll get in the uh, the digital toolkits. 
that was part two of the Make Your Own Comics Blank Comic Book uh, Review. I was specifically talking about the uh, ones with the borders and panels. So you can actually make a, a comic ready made. Well, I mean, the panels are ready made. You just uh, put in other stuff. And here are the ones with the, I think this is, yeah, the word balloons and caption boxes. And this has the really cool sound effects. I also showed some of the printed pages that I got from the Comic Maker Toolkit and Starter Kit. You can check out the links uh, below. Those are digital files. If you want to see uh, what what is in the kit, you can just go to Scott's uh, channel. And I'm going to be leaving a link to uh, the video directly where he talks about the Comic Maker Toolkit. Uh, the Comic Maker Toolkit and the Comic Maker Starter Kit so you can check out those videos. And right now that we're going through a, a crisis, uh, this is a perfect time to get yourself a few of these. Work on your comic at home, work on uh, just making some cool stuff. Work on, you can use these for just sketching, uh, whatever you want to uh, use them for. But, you know, you know, make something. Right now, there's a, a hashtag going around, hashtag crisis creation, and there's also hashtag crisis art, so you can use both of those hashtags. Put them on, on your social media, YouTube, uh, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, whatever social media you have, and just make stuff. Just make cool stuff and, you know, put a smile on people's faces. You know, right now, you know, people are trying not to uh, uh, freak out, so... Just use that time uh, to just just make make stuff and put it out there and you know make someone happy. And again, I can't recommend these enough. There's just so so much uh, uh, work that Scott has put into these. I mean, he's been making comics for a few years, so he, he put a lot of his his knowledge into into good use. And just you know, you can really see it just from you know, just looking at some of these pages that. You know, these are professionally made. These are done by someone that, that knows comics and wants you to make comics. Uh, so he makes it, makes it available for you. Uh, and even the, uh, the, the Comic Maker Toolkit and the Starter Kit, I mean, there's just so much, uh, so much stuff you, you get there. The, in the Starter Kit, I mean, you get a lot of stuff for free in the Toolkit. I mean, there's just so much, so much stuff in there. There's fonts, there's uh, half tones, there's the, the panels. Uh, so I do recommend you, you check out Scott's stuff, check out his channel, uh, subscribe to him if you're not subscribed. But that's it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching. If you've got any ideas, anything uh, you want to see me do, I'll probably be doing more videos now, now that there's a lot of time. So uh, I'll probably will be doing that manga video, uh, talking about the uh, make your own manga books, talking about them uh, in depth a little bit more, just showing them um, right here. So even these right now, these these are great to, to get. Just uh, they're pocket size, travel size, so if you have to go to the doctor or somewhere, just, uh, take one of these and just work work on some paneling, work, work, work on some sketches. <laughs> so uh, check these out. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget, tip your week.